Since Doctor Who star David Tennant thwarted J.K. Rowling's chance to cameo on the iconic BBC sci-fi series, the Harry Potter author has evidently held a grudge against the Scottish actor. Over a decade after the Doctor Who rejection, it seems the animosity remains, as inferred from J.K.'s recent remarks. Following the news that Kemi Badenoch has become the leader of the Conservative Party, J.K. took a swipe at the actor with a caustic tweet. David, who portrayed Barty Crouch Jr. in the film version of Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, has clashed with Kemi over her views on the LGBTQ plus community, once expressing his wish for her to shut up. He said in a speech, If I'm honest, I'm a little depressed by the fact that acknowledging that everyone has the right to be who they want to be and live their life how they want to live it as long as they're not hurting anyone else should merit any kind of special award or special mention, because it's common sense, isn't it? It is human decency, we shouldn't live in a world where that is worth remarking on. However, until we wake up and Kemi Badenoch doesn't exist anymore. I don't wish ill of her, I just wish her to shut up, whilst we do live in this world, I am honored to receive this. Badenoch responded at the time, I will not shut up. I will not be silenced by men who prioritize applause from Stonewall over the safety of women and girls. A rich, lefty, white male celebrity so blinded by ideology he can't see the optics of attacking the only black woman in government by calling publicly for my existence to end. Rowling's comment to Tennant comes after he reportedly rejected the idea of involving J.K. Rowling in Doctor Who fearing it would transform the beloved series into a spoof. The acclaimed writer was allegedly seeking a cameo that would eclipse Kylie Minogue's memorable Christmas special appearance. The proposal to include J.K. Rowling was disclosed through various emails published by Russell T. Davies. He noted at the time that the concept was shelved to keep him happy. Although this decision pleased David, it inadvertently ignited a long-standing rift between the actor and the author. The startling revelation about attempting to get Rowling involved came to light through various published correspondences from showrunner Russell T. Davies. Back then, Davies reportedly nixed the concept to keep him happy. At the time, Russell remarked, David doesn't like the JK idea. He thinks it sounds like a spoof, so we've paused slightly, wondering whether to win him round or just abandon something that H is not going to be happy with. We've got to keep him happy. He keeps us happy. It was noted that Russell had previously invited the author to pen an episode for the BBC series, but she politely declined.